Assalamu alaikum. Great afternoon. Boop, 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 boop. You already know who it is. Rising Phoenix, aka the flower. BKA. Redhead little orphan Annie. And you know she just got finished doing that. Good old, good old, good old Miss Jean. Whew. I'm hotter than fish grease. But you know, ooh, but you know why, don't you? You see what that say? I got my mama oven on. She would tell me, if you don't turn off my goddamn oven, you got it hotter than hell in here, Halima. <sighs> she ain't never lie. Huh, so y'all already know what time it is, don't you? Don't you? Gotta get a swig. Excuse me. For a second. This cup was given to me by my mother. So, it's helping me stay strong right now. So I wanted to take a second and uh, talk, you know, have a, have a chit chat, cause you know, it's one of them times. Um, I just figured, you know, I would sit and talk and be vulnerable with you for a while. This time in my life has been one of the hardest, most scariest times of my life. Um, I've gone back and forth about in my mind about how I wanted to convey things to you all. And, um, you know, Allah says, you know, it's time. I, you know, know that I have posted some things about prayer. I am currently COVID-19 positive. And my mother, who is also COVID-19 positive, along with having a bacterial pneumonia, is fighting for her life. At first, I felt like my world was coming to an end. I felt like God had forsaken me and I didn't understand at the time why. But then it came to me. When you change your life and God gives you mercy God, law, source, spirit, whatever you want to call him, when he grants you mercy to change your life and change your circumstances, within that, sometimes you are told to let certain things go in your life, whether that's a people, places, things, habits. You are instructed as you're growing and changing to leave certain things in the past. And when you start to look back because you think, hey, I, I've held so much, I'm strong enough, I can, I can deal with going to that place. I can deal with talking to that person. I can deal with that habit. <clears throat> you know, I'm, I'm strong enough, I, I didn't move. When you feel kind of like you didn't got there and you say, I can open myself up to certain things. That is where you start to begin to unravel and lose. Even the strongest of us still can be easy manipulated, easy changed, easy grabbed when you're not paying attention, when you're not listening correctly, when you, to to Allah's guidance to your angels to your ancestors 
you know, when they're trying to speak to you through not just your eyes, but your intuition, your wisdom, that third eye. <clears throat> that is when things start to happen. And when you ignore the warnings, when you ignore the signs and say, I got it, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Even though you're trying to still do good, when you get to a point where you feel like you're more, you you got it all figured out, that's when Allah will snatch your ass back and say, now, yeah, I done pulled you up from your bootstraps. Yes, I done blessed you. I done gave you this. I done gave you that. But you think I'm playing with you? I will take that shit back so damn fast. And when I take it back, I'm going to take some other shit back and I'm going to make you suffer. So that way, this time, you will know I'm not playing. When I say leave it, I mean leave it. So I'm telling you guys, as you move, as you grow, keep moving forward. Don't go back. Don't, don't think that you have gotten so far that you can't be pulled by your shirt collar. I cried, I begged, I pleaded, I screamed, I fought, I was quiet. I was ready to give up, I did. But that is when I remembered who daughter I was, who daughter I am. I am. I am Rising Phoenix, a.k.a. The Flower, b.k.a. Red Hair Little Orphan Annie, Halima Zakia Rahim, a.k.a. Lulu. So I said, get your ass up. Get your ass up. So I'm telling y'all. If I can get my ass up and I may be fighting and it may not be as easy for me to move, but if I can get my ass up and if my mama can, can fight, you can too. Okay. Get up, move, hold on to your faith, hold on to that spirit. Don't take your life for granted. Don't take others' life for granted. Live, y'all. Change. Transmute your energy. And that is what I'm doing. I know the power of mind, body, spirit, and heart. When you manifest and change your reality here first you can manifest anything into existence with almighty god allah backing you okay hey start with here so if you say i'm gonna lay down if you say oh it's over and so if you listen to that and you allow that to come in here and infect here it is going to affect everywhere else. So, I say, grab your can. I say, grab your water. I say, stand your ass up. And I say, rise. I say, fly. I say, prepare them damn wings and keep it moving. Okay? So, I'm telling y'all, my friends, my family, my colleagues, the people that know me, hear me. Hear my name. I ain't going nowhere. I ain't sitting down because my family needs me. My mother needs me. She going to rise. I'm going to rise because I'm rising Phoenix. And I'm Amina Zakia Rishdan daughter. So... Peace, love, and love.